Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Trisha Crane Minds Creations. And today I want to share with you um, a little bit of a haul that uh, was from Amazon and Hobby Lobby. Okay, and this is mostly, again, about my coloring. So I got a few things that I ordered from Amazon and I went by Hobby Lobby Monday. And I picked up a few things there that I want to show you. So I want to start with that first. And I'm going to put everything out the bag. And first, um, I'm going to come back to this later. I picked, I went to the um, clearance wall. I saw in the clearance wall that they had some St. Patrick's stuff. Because um, I don't have a lot of St. Patrick's stuff. I really don't craft in holidays that much really uh, and St. Master is one of them but uh, anyway they had some of the stickers it's like uh, 31 sticker, 31 piece of stickers here they all glitter and these are only 29 cents and I got a thing of sequins it's 15 one point women oh crap I don't remember what's in here they oh. 1.5 ounces and it's green and gold uh, sequins they're the small ones and these are only 29 cents so I got those and then I got these stickers they like uh, rainbows and uh, like a little pot of gold or a little gold gem and cloud and it's 12 pieces and it's 29 cents so well, we're, we're... and I've had some of these stickers and I decided to get some more of them. I think they only had two left and I got both of them. And I think it's like two or three sheets in here. And it's 34 pieces and they were 19 cents a piece. So I got two of those. And that is all of the um, St. Patrick's Day stuff that I got. Now these sequins, of course you can use these for other things. They don't necessarily have to be for St. Patrick's Day. Um, and I also picked up this coloring book. Um, it's by Christopher Hart. It's a manga coloring book for uh, of girls, and I like manga or um, anime. Uh, I'm not really into that much, but it, it's coloring, so whatever. And this book was originally nine ninety five, and I got it for two forty eight. It was uh, on clearance, so I got that. And I'll do a proper flip through on that later. And then I picked up these pencils. These are Sergeant Art pencils, 120 count pencils, and I thought that's a good deal when it was $7.49. Uh, originally $24.99. But then when I got home, I looked at this and I said 56 different colors. But I said, how's it 56 different colors? 120? I didn't think that was double colors. So um, these are all the colors that's on the back. Um, I'm not sure if I'll keep this again because I'm not sure about Sergeant Art brand for one, and it was the only last one left. So I said, "Well, I'll go ahead and get these, and if I don't like them, then I'll bring, I'll just take them back." Again, there was only seven dollars and forty nine cents, but the original price was twenty four ninety nine. So I guess it's not bad for one hundred twenty pencils, but you get uh, two of each of these colors, and some of you get three of the same color. So, I don't know if I'm going to keep these and probably um, use these in a giveaway or something. I don't know. I'm not sure. Or something. But, anyway, I'm going to uh, think more on this if I'm going to keep these or not. Okay, so that's everything that I got from Hobby Lobby this past Monday. And, um, uh, I got, um, a, I had to get me some pencil cases. I need to get, I still need some more. And I got some colored pencils and um, a coloring book. Oh, so first, I got this big old pack of South Sun 160 oil pencils. I seen reviews on these uh, on YouTube, and um, I think majority of the reviews are some that like the pencils because they're oil basically, and they you know they work good, and um, 
then some didn't like them. But I decided to go ahead and get them because, like, I again, I, I don't. It don't take a lot for me to like colored pencils, especially these are oil. And I'm going to be doing a swatch on this. This is gonna be another video. I'm gonna be doing a swatch. I'm gonna be doing the swatch thing in my book. I'll show you how to do the swatches in my book. But um, these are 160 oil pencils, and I haven't used them yet. I have them for a little over. I got them, I think they came, they came as last Friday. I got them last Friday. I love this case. It's good plastic, but the little case is five trays of these. But these little things are flimsy. So I had to order me another case. I ordered a case with these, but the case that came, that I ordered with them was like 120, um, the capacity. Well, this is 160, so I had to order another case for, um, these pencils. Okay, now, also on the review that I saw in the videos um, on these pencils, there were some that were South Sun, and apparently, um, they're Guangui pencils, um, as G-H-U-A-N-G-H-U-I, and it was funny because a lot of people in the videos, I was like, wasn't saying it right. And it's called, and, but you say it gung we, even though it's H U I. They would say hui, but it's actually we. But anyway, so, and then, uh, so on the pencils, that's what they were saying on their pencils. And I just noticed these the other day when I looked at them again, that these doesn't say gung we on them. They says brunt runner or brute runer. Um, I don't know if you can see that, but it's B U R T uh, R U N E R. A funer, brute funer, and so, um, but they did look the same, but they just have a different name on them, and uh, they are similar to the Hero Gungwe uh, pencils, and like I said, when I did some review on this actual, this said South Sun oil pencils, on their pencils they had written on it Gungwe, then I was like, okay, those are good. I mean, because I had ordered them before I had watched the reviews on them. And so I said, okay, they're good. And then again, if, you know, I don't like them, I just send them back. But most likely I won't be. Um, but I can see now that these have um, some uh, metallic pencils in here. These are this metal these three are metallic. These two are metallic. And then these two are here metallic. Again, these are like five trays of these. Um, uh, of course, I'm going to be putting these in the uh, uh, color family because you got greens on that tray, greens on this tray, and greens on this tray, and you know, so, um, so, I am going to be redoing these, and putting them, uh, in the right order that I want them in, and this is, these are metal, uh, I'm sorry, metallic ones, from here to here, these are all metallics, so, I think that's it, so yeah, so these are, 160 oil pencils and I will be doing a thorough review on those when I do um, the color swatch or I might do those two separate things I'll probably go ahead and do it all in one because I don't want to do too many videos just on these pencils but yeah so um, they also come with a color chart a color list like the swatch book I just showed you guys this came with it now I may use this but I'm still going to put these in my swatch book that I made because um, I'm not going to be pulling this. I'm not going to, they're not going to stay in this. So I may use this on occasion as a reference to my, uh, the colors, but I'm still going to be swatching these in my color swatch book. So this did come with that. And I've seen uh, other reviews on other pencils, not particularly these, but other, but they did come with something like a color chart, color list like this, where you can swatch the colors on. Um, so I guess that was a good thing. So I'm just going to put these back in here. And it was funny because another thing when I saw other people in the reviews, they were taking their pills. I was taking them out one tray at a time. Um, like, I think that's one reason why their, um, the little case was chipping on me the first time I opened them. The little flimsy case, but then it was, uh, cracking on me and everything. I just took them out at the same time. So, um, I'm going to be doing another video on these here soon because I'm anxious to try them out and um, see how they go. So that's the uh, Chinese side writing and the English side. But yeah, so I got those from, oh, and these were, how much were these? These were, I think, 
Uh, crap, let me see. I don't know. I'll If uh, you're interested, I'll just link these where I got these on Amazon uh, in the description box below. But they were like... I think they were twenty nine ninety nine or thirty nine thirty something or twenty nine ninety nine, um, something like that. But again, I'll link the uh, to that in the um, description box below. And I, when I ordered that, I also ordered this case. Now it came in this box. It was a nice box. I'm gonna use this for something, you know, art it for something. Um, and I like these kind of boxes. So this is the box that came in, and this is like it holds one hundred twenty one pencils. And this is the uh, the thing. It's uh, like the faux leather, and it has three sections. And I, I just grab them all, and and then unzip them like this. And I put my 100 count Crayolas and my 20 count of uh, Prismacolors in here. And I put all my. Uh, Color pills, Crayola color pencils first. I guess that you can put like a eraser or a pencil sharpener here on the big spots. But again, this is her 120 pencils. Um, so these are my Crayolas, and I, you know, put them in a, a gradient color form. And that's that. These are all my Crayolas, and I got two spaces left. And then uh, these are all of my Prisma colors, the Verithins, the Verithins. Uh, wait a minute. Uh, yeah, these are the 20 count of uh, prism colors that I have and um, I don't know I think this is so short these couple of these are so short these because um, the lid kept breaking in them and then the black too because I hardly ever use these again because like I said the in the last video these um, it's only 20 colors 22 colors 20 colors Something like that. So I don't use these very often. Sometimes I'll use them in conjunction with the color with Crayolas or the other Prisma colors that I have. But I don't use these very much. So this is the case that it came with, and I like it. I like this case. It's smaller in dimension as far as my other case that my uh, Thornton color pencils came in. It's slightly smaller, and this one actually has a carry strap on it too, which I can take off if I want. But um. So far, I like this case. And then, so, um, like I said, I ordered the case and uh, the, those colored pencils together. And I don't know what I was thinking, but 160 pencils won't fit in a 120 uh, colored pencil case. So, I had to order another case. So, um, I got, this came yesterday. I already opened the Amazon box. But I didn't, you know, actually take it out yet. So, uh, this is the one I chose. And, um, I like black, you know, just basic colors. So, but this is, came in blue. It came, this is black came in, it didn't come in black. But it came in blue, gray, and another color. Which I didn't really care for. So, I, I said, like, let's try something other than gray. And I started to get the gray, but I got the blue one instead. And so, this one comes with a little case. I mean, a handle on it. And, like I said, this is my first time opening it. So, I don't know. And it opens up like this. Yeah. It opens up like this and it folds out all like that. And then this one opens out like this. Uh, yeah, this is one side. So that's like that. It makes it folds back in like so. And these are this the cases that my pencil just showed you I was gonna go in. I'm not gonna put these i put those in here until I swatch them in my book. Uh, do the swatch color on that. So, I think I'm going to like this case. Hmm. And it's um, like a more like a canvas uh, type material. And I like the, the uh, handle on it. So, that's neat. And with that, I also ordered this book. that came separate, which this came today. And this is um, a, another dark coloring book that I ordered. And where are my scissors? Uh, I thought I said the little ones because my big ones are on my other desk. And I don't feel like getting up. Oh, what? No, oh, there. They're there. Okay. So, I got this. This came today. <clears throat> oh, I'm out on these scissors. And it's another dark coloring book. And this is a uh, mystical fantasy coloring book. And, um, same with that case, 
Uh, I will link it also in the description box in case I just showed the blue one. If anybody wants to um, go and pick that up. And I'll also link the book. Uh, I think the book was only eight something. I can't remember. But anyway, wait a minute. That first case was $16.99 or something like that. And the second case was like 20 something. I think it was 20 dollars or something it wasn't very much so i got this mystical fantasy coloring book it's a dark one by molly harrison and these are the pictures on the back i'll do a, again a proper flip through on this one later but these are the colored pages that i'm assuming that are in the book and these are one-sided huh hmm. pages are kind of thin they feel like um copy paper uh, paper so they're not really thick but I like the images so we'll find out we'll hide this, the pages color in this I mean they're they're really thin but um so we'll see and I like mermaids and fairies and unicorns and things like that so I went ahead and got that yeah so again, these are the pages in the book, and I, I'll do a proper flip through on this one later. And I think that is it. And I'm going to show you guys. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot I got something else from Hobby Lobby. I got these uh, watercolor um, brushes. And it comes with three in a pack. They were five dollars. I see another set of them. They were like $11, $12, $11.99, $12, something like that. I'm like, uh, yeah, I could I could use a coupon one, but I still won't pay that much for those things. So I'm like, I want to try to choose because I'm not really into watercolor, so I didn't want to spend a lot of money on something that I'm not sure if I'm gonna like. But um, these um, you put water in the barrel here, you screw this off, and you put water in the in there, and then you can uh, instead of dipping using a, uh, the other kind of paintbrush. And dipping it in water, you could just squeeze the barrel because it's like a plastic and um, squeeze the water out to uh, water coat these. Now, you come a small, medium, and large. Uh, the red is small, or pink is small, the green is medium, and the blue is the large brush. So, yeah, so I'm going to be trying these out with my watercolors that come with my. Um, Thorns are supply uh, pencils, and I'll uh, see how these work out. And again, these are $5.99. I did use a coupon on these because everything else I bought was on clearance. So, yeah. So, that is what I wanted to show you guys today. And um, I will be doing a color swatch soon on those markers, or um, see those color pencils. So, um, I hope that um, I get some followers for my coloring. And uh, you like this video and give me a thumbs up or the or comment on this video. And thanks you guys for watching and uh, subscribing to my channel. And especially to you new subscribers as well. Um, I really appreciate you um, subscribing to my channel because I, I'm not really into... Um, I don't know. I'm not going to say that. <laughs> but uh, yeah. So guys, uh, thanks for watching and you all have a crafty day. Bye.